Hi, it's Natalie from Red Fox Property Group and today I'm at 147 Burkitt Street in Bedford. The top three things we love about this property. Number one, the block size, 574 square metre street front lot. Oodles of space out the front, out the side and out the back to do what you like with, subject to council approval of course. Number two has got to be the house, super cute mid-century cottage all of the features you adore, move in ready as is, but again, an opportunity to add further value down the track. And number three, and it comes back to the land size, 574 square metres, that's roughly a land value of around about 600K. So I think this is a super great entry level into this fabulous suburb. Let's go and take a look around. We're in the formal entry, you've got beautiful Jarrah floors, you've got the lovely high ceilings, the lovely gorgeous picture rails, all of the things that these mid-century cottages are famous for. I particularly like the fireplace in this one, ornamental, really pretty, lovely surround. Don't know if that's original or it's been put in since, but it is gorgeous and provides such a beautiful focal point to the room. We've got the timber sash windows there at the front, um, nice um, cornicing there, the picture rails that you can see to hang your art. I'm gonna come back around, beautiful proportions in this as well. Floor plans are online and it's got the original sliding door with the wood pelmet, which I really love with this gorgeous kind of frosted glass there, really, really pretty. So back round to the entry, front door there. First of the bedrooms is off here to the right. So this is the main bedroom. It's the largest of the three. Beautiful proportions, you know, all these homes, gorgeous proportions in the original rooms. So lovely rows there. Again, the timber frame sash windows at the front, and you've got a nice big bank of robes here. So we've got a queen size bed, we've got bedsides, and we've got ample space. Linen closet here, which is terrific. I'm going to come through to bed two. So again, really great proportions. We've got a double bed, we've got a bedside there, we've got a chair tucked in there, and we've got this lovely big bank of robes in here. So good size again. Bathroom, all renovated as you can see. We've got a lovely suspended vanity, hello, face height storage, shower, and there's a little freestanding cabinet tucked around there. Kitchen meals area, beautiful size. I'm like, seriously, I want this table. It is just stunning and it fits so beautifully in the space. As you can see, it's all been updated. We've got a really nice splashback, really just neat and tidy. Fridge recess there. We'll swing around, you can see the oven that's got a gas cooktop, dishwasher. Love that stainless steel sort of butler's sink. A little bit of overhead cupboard space there. Nice big double pantry there, microwave tucked away. And as you can see, another beautiful sliding door which matches the one in the lounge through there. But you've got a nice kind of walkthrough area here. So this was the original back sleep out. It's now got a little study nook, bed three, which I'll show you in a sec. And we've got the laundry and the loo through there. But here is the study nook. That would have been the original window through to the bathroom. So that's been boarded up. And we've got bed three tucked away in here. So really neat and tidy, split system aircon on the wall, double bed, room for bed signs. We've got a nice big piano here. So you could see that certainly a wardrobe would fit really comfortably there too. Let's go and have a look out in the backyard. The backyard. This is one of my favourite parts of the home. As I mentioned earlier, it's a really large lot. So you've got all of this wonderful outdoor space. I love this covered decked alfresco entertaining area. It is just beautiful. I love that old original crazy paving that's there. We've got a nice bit of lawn. We've got um, lots of like, lots and lots of space out here. We've got this lovely area, little raised garden bed area and a nice little paved area up here with the fire pit. 
and you can see there's a nice big garden shed up there as well we've got a chook pen off here to the side now there is heaps of room down the side of the house i'm not going to go there today but you'll see that on the weekend you've got so much space out there to do something with but what i want to draw your attention to is the outdoor bath and shower i know what a really nice surprise so it's here you can screen this off light all your candles or just have a beautiful outdoor path you know when the weather permits or i reckon the nice thing is when it's slightly cold get this nice and toasty hot sit out here with your mulled wine bliss so just a really beautiful space to relax entertain in and enjoy location this one is in a super convenient spot 120 meters up the road is walter road west with its buses to and from the city 260 meters away you get mother indian vegetarian restaurant and the local bedford favorite red man kachina for your coffees and egg and bacon rolls 450 meters you'll find grand prom a little bit further from that about 750 meters you've got our table restaurant then Django small bar and the Bedford IGA. Two k's away up the road, you've got Coventry Village and Morley Galleria. And in the opposite direction, two k's approximately, you've got Inglewood Coles and the start of the Inglewood Social Precinct. What is not to love? Call me now 0405 812 273 for more details or we'll see you at a home open. Have a great day.